Hi guys, Adam here from Darts Planet TV and today we are reviewing the Data Dart Spectrals. Spectral! Right then, the Data Dart Spectrals, uh, 25 grams. Looking at the box, it's quite a nice little package box. It's got the information on the front that we've just bought a 25 gram, 90% tungsten dart, match weighted to 0.3 of a gram, um, give or take a plus or a minus. Um, we'll turn the box out. Oh, you've got, oh, I just mentioned there's a little window there with one dart already set up showing you. Um, and then we'll turn the dart over and it's got uh, a little link there to Facebook and Instagram and the website on the back and a bit of information there about the dart. So we'll open the box and have a look inside. Okay, so they actually come, all three of them already made up for us. So, um, first glance at these um, is, it's quite an interesting sort of shaped barrel really. It's, I, I suppose we class this as a bull nose at the front and then it's got uh, some circular grip there etched in at the front and then some straight lines etched in there and then going back to the standard ringed grip and then we've got the Data Dart logo and then uh, it slightly tapers thinner here towards the stem at the back and that's a bit of a sharp grip really. Um, it's come with the medium length shafts and uh, Data Dart flights, which I'd say by the feel of them are about 150 microns. So, uh, we'll go and give these a chuck. Right then guys, so, let's have 12 darts with the Data Dart Spectral. First handful coming in. And we've gone off to a steady 60, but um, yeah, I'm holding these again fairly sort of to the back, well mid, mid to back. Um, and uh, if I keep my arms straight, they go fairly straight really, which again, sort of shows that the dart's fairly well balanced and flies straight. So if you keep your arms straight, in theory, there isn't a lot to go wrong. Apart from that, good old drift to the fives. Two drifts to the five. Um, the barrel is quite wide, it's 6.8 mil. So when you have a barrel that's about 6.8 mil, it is slightly wider than normal, but Again, we'll kick over another ton, so I'm going to have one more handful with these because I want to get a decent score with them. So let's try this go. And we've got another ton, but um, yeah, they're, I think they're £48.50 online. Um, so we'll go and have a little summary on these in a moment. Cheers. Right then guys, so the summary on the Data Dart Spectrals. Um, not a bad dart actually, quite nice. Uh, retail for around about 48 quid, um, which is in the current market, what seems to be pretty much the average price these days for a set of darts. Um, slightly maybe just the high end of average. Um, the sort of different grip patterns all down the barrel was pretty good. Um, the idea behind that is for varying throwing styles. So you can hold the barrel in different places, etc., etc. et cetera. Um, not exactly the ideal dart for me, but again, that's down to you guys to choose. Uh, I've always been a big fan of Data Dart, and I do bark about them quite a lot, because I think they do make a really nice dart, and they kind of get forgotten about a little bit. So keep an eye out on the Data Dart stuff, because they've always, for years now, produced really good darts. So, in summary for them, not a bad dart. So, next week, we will be reviewing and unleashing for you a set of... Simon Whitlock, PVD Rainbow Darts. So, keep an eye out for them. Okay, so, the end bit now. So, loads to remember. Turn on your subs. Please start turning on your subs. Subscribe to me. I want you to love me. Um, <laughs> and turn on your notifications, so that way you'll know when I'm here. It will be brilliant. And also, the Dart Review site. Keep an eye out for it. It's going to be brilliant. Cheers. So that's it guys. I really, really, really hope you enjoyed this review and it's helped you in some way. Make sure you download the Darts Reviews TV app, which is available now for free on the App Store and the Google Play Store. Oh, and before you go, have you missed this review?